डे टेन सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस डब्ल्यू हेच क्वेश्चन सो वी हैव सो मेनी डब्ल्यू हेच क्वेश्चन लाइक वेर वेन वाई वॉट विच होम हु एंड सो ऑन सो द स्ट्रक्चर फॉर दिस इज यू कीप द डब्ल्यू हेच बिफोर द क्वेश्चन सो डब्ल्यू हेच प्लस डू डज और डोंट डज प्लस सब्जेक्ट प्लस वी वन प्लस ऑब्जेक्ट इट्स रियली एज सिंपल एज दैट सो examples like what do you do in the office where do you live why don't you like ice creams or why do you like ice creams when does sita wake up daily which college do you attend with whom with whom do you go to movies how do you go daily how was the wh question it also has w and h so it becomes a wh question how do you go daily who drops you daily so these are all questions wh questions about regular actions so it comes under simple present tense now let's do exercise 1 let us try to acquaint ourselves with the structure and um, understand the sentences in simple present wh questions the first one is what do you want now why did we get why did we get what do you want because you have you there and do you want you place the w wh before do it becomes a wh question it's really as simple as that how do you come to school this is correct because uh, you have you there and with you you have to place the do and so you get how do you how just remains like that before the do how many films that's a wh sub so wh can have many words also this is one example how many films now you can't say how many films you see in a month you should say in perfect english how many films do you see in a month because this is a regular action it is a wh question you will either get do or don't or does or doesn't here it comes as do why do you like andhra food why don't you change your behavior now it is again you so don't comes before you and wh comes before don't it's really as simple as that wh do uh, you start the sentence with wh next immediately you give the helping verb do does don't or doesn't sixth question how do you dance again you got you there actually you get a lot of questions with you because normally in conversations you talk to a person so you definitely get you like that how do you dance seventh one when do you get up eighth one now eighth you have he so you get doesn't why doesn't he sing a song ninth one ninth one is pavan so pavan is singular where does pavan write the exam tenth one where do you go eleventh one why don't you clap twelfth one why don't we go for a walk thirteenth why don't they wait for us so again all these places you got don't eleventh twelfth and thirteenth because it was you we and they with u v and they you get don't before the don't you have to only place just place the wh question 14th whom do you like most whom do you like most again you do and whom it comes in that order 15th where do you our parents live 16th how much so how much can be a wh question how much you pay for mobile phone would be wrong not in perfect english uh, you have to say how much do you pay because it's a regular action and you have to use wh questions 17th where do you play cricket 18th why do we shiver why do we shiver 19th who decorates the hall now notice here you did not get a helping verb here in 19th you did not get a helping verb because with who the who itself becomes a subject so when with who you don't require a helping verb so remember this small uh, side rule with who you don't require the helping verb because who itself is a subject you don't have a subject before which you have to keep the do or don't or does or doesn't so who decorates the hall 20th why do some pe pe people behave greedily why do some people behave greedily you get do here because some people is plural 
why do you cry why doesn't he shave isn't it because with he you get doesn't why do you cheat your friend why don't we have tea when do they announce the result so when do they announce the result it's a regular action every time they announce at one particular time and you are asking about that particular time so i i hope it is clear here with who you do not get do does doesn't and don't but for the rest you get do does doesn't don't with the wh question and you start with the wh immediately put the helping verb then you put the subject and then the rest so that completes uh exercise no uh, one and now we come to exercise 2 where you have clue words and you have to make the wh question use the following clues and make sentences in the above structure exercise 2 first one which you like most tea or coffee which do you like most which do you like most tea or coffee second one uh, you where do you park you it is you so you get do where do you park your bike third one how do we get our lunch fourth one fourth one can it be is it do or does yes it's does because it is she why does she smile fifth one uh, uh, why do you change your hairstyle is a regular action he keeps changing his hairstyle and the questioner is asking now we come to the seventh um, sentence number 7 and the clue words are why they quarrel now this is a regular action so with they we put do or does yes we put do not does so the structure will be why do they quarrel now eighth one you comb your hair frequently why these are the clue words in the eighth one again with you you get do so you uh, there's a helping verb you get do in regular actions so why do you comb your hair frequently ninth one again you got you again it's very simple you have to put only do so when do you clean the room tenth one again we got they with they we use do how do they open the windows eleventh one now in eleventh we have got we where do we watch movies with we you have to get do not does so we again it comes to do it's very simple you can see the structure where do we uh, is the structure now we come to the 12th one again you got you there why you suspect him with you what helping verb will you get we have already done many many sentences like that we get do so why do you suspect him 13th why do they speak roughly again with they you get do so why do they speak roughly 14th now 14th we get he with he as you know it's not do it's does so where does he buy those dresses so where does he buy those dresses because it's he 15th as also is he again why does he shiver does he shiver because it's he third person singular you get does as the helping verb and the structure is why does he shiver 16th when do we laugh 17th 17th now 17th is a wh with negative questions so let's see that dog that dog is a third person singular a singular whom you are pointing out so we put does but does plus not is doesn't So how will the structure come? Why doesn't that dog bark? That's how the structure comes. Very clear, very simple. Eighteenth, what they practice in the hall. Again, they has come here. So again, as usual, it is do not does. What do they practice in the hall? This is a regular action. All these sentences are regular actions. Okay, we are asking questions about regular actions. Nineteenth. how do you cross the bridge because you got you again you have do how do you cross the bridge so you see any sentence you take you can put the right helping verb and that is the beauty and wonder of english because it is so simple 20th the policeman now the policeman 
is definitely third person singular why does the policeman because it's third person singular we get does there uh, 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 when does the policeman catch thieves 21st you why you forget your keys why do you forget your keys because with you you get do 22nd again 22nd is a wh negative question so the parallel lines the parallel lines plural so what do you get do or does yes we get do do plus not is don't so why don't the parallel lines meet 23rd again stars where the stars move uh, are the clue words so what about the stars the stars uh, are plural so you you have to put do or does yes we put do so where do the stars move so it's a matter of just deciding which helping verb to put and putting it in the right order the order is the structure 24th what do you do with the many last one when do you go to tirupati so that completes the that completes the wh questions in simple present tense that is regular actions and now you can do the exercise 3 you can use 10 verbs in the verb list and make sentences on your own uh, and you will find that you are very easily able to make the sentences and then you will understand that you indeed have become confident in using the wh questions in simple present tense i hope you enjoyed the program thank you